Hello friends, welcome to our channel Bananis Garden. In this video, we are going to show how to grow Malabar spinach at rooftop garden in our very small space. It is the end of March here in India. The winter season is over now. This is the perfect time to sow the seeds of Malabar spinach. We will use this plastic container to sow the seeds. As you can see, we have already built the plant support system. The soil mixture that we are using contains 40% garden soil, 40% organic compost and 20% sand. These are the seeds of Malabar spinach. You do not need to soak them before sowing. First, dig the top soil a little and make holes in the soil. We are adding some more cow dung compost. Make half inch holes in the soil and put the seeds in the holes. We are sowing 6 seeds in total. Cover the seeds with soil, add water and put the whole system under direct sunlight. Make sure the soil remains always moist. This will help the seeds to germinate. After 4 days, only 2 seeds are germinated. After 6 days, all of the seeds are germinated. So as you have seen, we got 100% germination. Day 8 The seedlings are growing nicely. After 13 days, the seedlings look nice and green. In total, 6 seedlings are there. We will keep 4 of them and remove others. Otherwise, they will not get enough food from this small container. Choose the weak plants to remove. If the plant is away from other plants, you can just uproot it. But if all the saplings are very close to each other, then you should not do this. Because this may disturb the root systems of the other plants. Just cut the stem nearest to the soil. Day 33 These are the most healthy plants in our garden now. Day 42 The plants are growing nicely. But they got libitor insect attack. To solve this, we will use organic pesticide neem oil. Dissolve 5 ml of neem oil in 2 liters of water and spray twice in a week until the problem is solved. After 50 days, the branches have become longer. Today, we will bind them to the roof of the support system with strings. Do not bind them too tightly, otherwise the delicate branches will be damaged. After 55 days, the branches are following the strings and trying to climb up. You need to keep applying the neem oil spray once in a week. This will keep most of the problems away from your Malabar spinach plants. Day 60 Two months have passed. The plants got multiple branches. Today, we will cut some of them and clear the bottom part of the plants. This is important. Always keep the base area of any plant clean and clear, so that direct sunlight can reach that area. Otherwise. Your plant may get fungal and bacterial attack. These branches are very fresh and ready for cooking. So as you have seen, you can start cutting the branches of Malabar spinach just after 2 months of sowing the seeds. You can cut the branches and use for cooking whenever you need them. New branches will be formed very soon. After 80 days, today we will take some more branches. We will also remove the old leaves and the unwanted branches from the base area. Day 86 As we have said earlier, new branches have formed within just 6 days.
After 90 days, the plants are covering the roof of the structure very fast. Day 102 Whenever you see the bottom part of the plant is being crowded with branches, cut them. Now let's talk about the pesticides. As you said previously, we use neem oil once in a week. We also use fungicide spray once in a month during the rainy season. After 120 days. In the meantime, we collected the branches multiple times from the plants. Now let's talk about the additional nutrients that you need to use. From one month after sowing the seeds, we are using the mixture of 60% cow dung compost and 40% garden soil in every month to boost up the soil fertility. At the time of the rainy season, we add 2 tablespoons of fungicide to this mixture. You can use NPK 10 to 26 to 26 once in 2 months if your plants are not growing well. 1 tablespoon of this NPK will be enough for all of these plants. After 140 days, the branches have covered the whole roof of the structure. Keep these plants under full sunlight. They need a lot of water. You might have to water them twice a day in the summer. This is day 155. This is after 160 days of sowing the seeds. This is the best scene that we have ever recorded. The leaves are healthy and green. These plants are going to provide the branches for the next few months. Let us know in the comment section what do you think about this video. If you think we have succeeded to take care of these plants properly then please hit the like button and subscribe our channel. Or if you think we have missed something let us know about that also. This will help us to improve our next works. Thank you so much for being with us till the end. Hope we will again meet in the next video.